before we begin, I want to give a thank you in the utmost to Will Ryan on the Doom Creator server for informing me that this issue that has come about from a redesign is not something that I was solely having, I just thought I was sucking at platforming, but is instead a widespread thing that is affecting all players. So to summarize what exactly has been going on with Dash, there has been an alteration made of some sort where only with specific walls you will be maneuvered in a slightly different direction when you dash towards them. You will have, as far as we are aware, absolutely no ways of changing your direction when you get moved in this specific way, and it isn't going to move you in a way that could allow you to ledge boost which could potentially be useful for speedrunners and such. Personally, I have been having this problem since update 6.6, .6, but that was also prior to me knowing that it was even a problem to begin with. And personally, I think this says something amended software, and I think it's finally time that more people know about it. We're able to reason that this sort of thing is deliberate because it only happens with certain walls, which probably shows that it's an error. Prior to this, you probably would have just pressed against the wall and have nothing happen to you but now you do get jolted in a particular direction. Naturally, this would cause issues in combat, because if you're dashing around and evading projectiles, it's very likely that you'll end up bashing into one of these walls that could so happen to have this problem. But the thing is, is that the fact that it only happens with certain walls is our only basis of having some sort of idea that this is a deliberate change. And, simultaneously, unsurprisingly, but unfortunately, it is not cited on Doom Eternal's update 6.6 .6 patch notes at all. I'm tired, boss. I'm tired of being on the road, long as a spell in the rain. In terms of communication and relationships between the community and a game developer, its software and the Doom community is a very good one. It's just that this has been something ongoing I'm sure that you're all aware of it at this point. If the additional walls are indeed for performance related issues, it would be nice to know the details, because these things tend to feel like they're put there to prevent specific skips. For example, this For reference, this video made by Under Vameo, particularly in regards to the speedrun community, came out more than half a year ago now. And that isn't the entire amount of time this sort of miscommunication has been going on anyways. But just seeing something that's been so quintessential to the game's core mechanics movement being altered this way and having barely anything said about it, even knowing if it was deliberate or not, it's just a real shame. And honestly, I'm really disappointed in you, id software. This isn't gonna be like my dear id software or anything, trust me, I never wanna see that sort of stuff happen again, but this has just been really disappointing. If you could all spread awareness about this in any way or form, it would honestly be greatly appreciated. Pump has already talked about this in a previous video that I'm sure all of you have seen by now but it would be great to get more and more people hearing about this in any ways possible. I hope you all have a good morning, noon, afternoon, evening, or night, and I'll see you in the next one.